cleaning down the brass rod to be used in making the clang, reloading the clang up in the mission. Now that's the proper diameter of this brass collar, or what will be a collar is currently a solid bore. Uh, this brass collar will be bored out to a diameter of 1564. First I'll make the pilot here. That will give the drill some place to go in the center of the piece. I place some uh, cutting fluid on the drill bit. You can of course use WD-40 if you don't have cutting fluid. And now commence the drilling. I'll drill this uh, brass bar all the way through, out the other side. That'll become the template or the guide for when I drill out the primer pockets. Stop them. We now have a brass sleeve with a centered 1564 inch hole which will then be inserted into a Martini Henry case, thusly. That will guide the drill when I bore out the burden primer at the back. Here's the arrangement being used to drill out the primer. I've got my sleeve, which will fit very nicely over this drill, which will then protrude the necessary amount to drive out the primer. At the same time, my sleeve will guide the drill to the center of the primer pocket. The drill bit I'm using is a size B, which is just a little bit bigger than a 1564. Um, you can use a 1564, but you're going to need a press to get the primer seated. Um, in reality, the primer pocket should be midway between a size B and a size C drill bit. However, the size C drill bit is four three was that four two zero uh, diameter, which is just a little bit too big. Uh, I get good results using a size B. In this aspect of the operation, we're using a half inch drill here. Uh, that is just to create a chamfered area around the primer pocket, which will allow the lip of the shotgun primer to recess into. Here's your chamfered area. Hopefully, it'll focus on that. That way the shotgun primer lip will sit just below the head of the case, which will allow the Martini Henry bolt to close. Okay, here is one of the cases that's been a Kynock case that's been modified uh, to take a shotgun primer. You can see it's recessed not protruding and by coincidence there's a martini henry carbine over here so let me put this empty prime case in there snap it closed let's see if it works i guess we should watch that in right yes it works removal of the fired shotgun primer is accomplished by taking that sleeve I made, dropping it into a cartridge, taking a piece of drill rod or something similar, and just simply tapping it out. 